What's up guys, TJ with Tech Paradise here. So in this episode of Online Math, I'll be showing you Gemini. Now, Gemini has been around for a while, so I'm sure some of you, maybe even a lot of you, probably have heard of it and maybe even have it on your maps, but just in case you don't, this is a great app for finding and removing duplicate files on your system easily. Now, it is currently $10 on the Mac App Store, and sometimes you can get it on sale, um, or you can get it in bundles, some of else, but it's $10 on the Mac App Store, and I believe it's well worth every dollar. Um, I had not been using it for a while, like I said, and so um, I've had plenty of experience with it, and in my experience, it, it's phenomenal. It works exactly as it's supposed to. Um, it has never deleted or removed something that I didn't expect it to. So it's really great for that reason. And uh, another thing that you should keep in mind though is that it does not remove iTunes files. The reason for that is you wouldn't want to delete something in your iTunes library which could corrupt something else. So that's just something to keep in mind. So with that being said, let me go ahead and show you a quick little, uh, I'll call it an, a stupid demo, meaning I'm not going to actually start going through my actual files um, to do now, but I'll, I'll give you a quick demo so you can see the interface. It brings up your um, your your finder interface here, and then let's just say I want to make sure I have no duplicate applications. Now obviously I don't have any duplicate applications, but we'll just say let's scan it. So while it's scanning, it gives you some cute little phrases down here as you can see. I am Gemini, oh I Gemini am actually a duplicated file magician. So it's kind of funny how it gives you that. So it's going to scan my applications right now, and um, Obviously, like I said, you're not going to find it in it. I don't have any duplicate apps, but it's just showing you the, the interface of it really is all that I'm doing now. And uh, while it's doing its thing, uh, I'll just tell you that, like I said a few minutes ago, it really is just well worth every dollar and one of the essential Mac apps that I think you have to have. And it should, it should finish up any time now because I know I don't have any duplicate apps. But again, it's not just, with, you know, you can do this with entire drives. Um, just keep in mind that once you get over 50 gigabytes of things that could be duplicates, um, I've read other reviews and I've actually experienced myself, not quite 50 gigs myself, but I've had higher, uh, higher gigabyte amounts that when that happens it does tend to not necessarily choke but it does kind of uh, slow down a bit but if you're just talking about smaller duplicate you know files that it finds it's relatively fast and of course it just gives you a new thing down here I can read new life into here and that so it kind of gives you that you know those little messages while you wait and it's going to keep scanning my, my applications folder, but it's not going to find anything, so we can say cancel. But that gives you a little look at what this app does. I didn't want to make this video too long, but the best way to get the opinion of this app is to just try it yourself. Um, like I said, you won't go wrong. It's a great utility to have. With that being said, thanks for watching, and please hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. I really appreciate everyone's support. Until next time, have a great day.